Hi, welcome back to the channel. Resetting a car's computer by disconnecting the battery is a common practice used to resolve minor electronic issues or reset fault codes that trigger warning lights on the dashboard. This procedure, often referred to as a hard reset, can help reset the electronic control unit and return the vehicle to its default factory settings. Modern vehicles are equipped with multiple electronic control units, or ECUs for short, often referred to collectively as the car's computer. The ECU is responsible for monitoring and managing various systems in the vehicle, including the engine, transmission, braking, and emissions control. Additionally, the ECU can store error codes, or diagnostic trouble codes, when it detects an issue within the car's systems, which in turn activates the warning lights on the dashboard. When you disconnect the car's battery, it cuts power to the ECU, which can clear temporary faults, reset codes, and restore the computer to its default state. There are several reasons why someone might want to reset the car's computer. Some of the most common include The check engine light can be triggered by a variety of issues. Once the underlying problem is fixed, the light might remain on. Resetting the computer clears stored trouble codes, potentially turning off the light. A reset might be necessary after performing repairs on engine components, like replacing sensors, to ensure that the ECU adapts to new conditions and parameters. Sometimes the ECU may store incorrect codes or temporary faults that are no longer relevant. A reset helps to remove any erroneous codes. After replacing the battery, it can be helpful to reset the ECU to allow it to recalibrate and adjust to the new power source. While disconnecting the battery can reset the car computer, the length of time to leave it disconnected varies depending on the make and model of the car and its electrical system. However, as a general rule of thumb, you should leave the battery disconnected for at least 15 minutes. Here's why. Modern ECUs often store residual power through capacitors that need time to drain completely. This ensures that any remaining electricity in the system is eliminated, effectively resetting the computer. By waiting at least 15 minutes, you give the car's computer ample time to fully shut down, erase memory, and reset to factory settings. For vehicles with more complex electrical systems, leaving the battery disconnected for up to 30 minutes may be recommended to ensure the reset process is effective. To perform the reset safely and correctly, follow these steps. Before starting, ensure the vehicle is turned off and the keys are removed from the ignition. Pop the hood and locate the car's battery. The battery typically has two terminals, a positive terminal marked with a plus symbol and a negative terminal marked with a symbol. Using a wrench or socket, loosen the bolt on the negative terminal first, the black cable. Disconnecting the negative terminal first is crucial because it prevents the risk of short-circuiting the system while working on the battery. Once the negative terminal is disconnected, you can then proceed to disconnect the positive terminal, the red cable. Leave the battery disconnected for at least 15 minutes this duration ensures that any stored power is fully drained and allows the ECU to reset. After waiting, reconnect the positive terminal first, followed by the negative terminal. Make sure the connections are secure. Once the battery is reconnected, start the vehicle and let it idle for a few minutes. This allows the ECU to recalibrate and relearn the vehicle settings, such as air fuel ratios and idle speed. Although resetting the car computer by disconnecting the battery it is generally a straightforward process, there are a few things to keep in mind. Resetting the ECU will erase any personalized settings in the vehicle, such as radio presets, clock settings, and seat adjustments. These will need to be manually reprogrammed after the reset. After an ECU reset, the car's readiness for emissions testing might be affected. The system will need to go through a driving cycle to gather enough data for testing. This may take several miles of driving before the ECU relearns necessary parameters. In some cases, resetting the computer may not fix underlying problems, especially if the issue is mechanical or involves faulty parts. If the problem persists, it is best to consult a professional mechanic or to use an OBDI scanner to diagnose the specific fault codes. Resetting the car computer by disconnecting the battery is a useful tool for clearing error codes, 
resolving dashboard warning lights, and recalibrating the vehicle's systems. The recommended time to leave the battery disconnected is 15 to 30 minutes, depending on the complexity of the vehicle's electrical system. However, this method is not a guaranteed fix for every issue, and persistent problems should be evaluated by a professional mechanic. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share, and also subscribe to this channel for more informative videos.